Hello guys, my name is Branch and welcome to Digital Rule Videos. Today in this video, I'm gonna be showing you how to convert this to this, and that means I'm gonna show you how to add snow effect in Adobe Photoshop. So now, without wasting our time, let's get started. First, you will need a wallpaper, so you can choose any you want. Now, after opening the wallpaper in Photoshop, you will first have to duplicate the layer by pressing Windows Ctrl plus J on your keyboard, right here. Now next we have to add some filters so that the snow effect does not look dull. So go to the filter option and then choose camera raw filter. After clicking that a new window will pop up where you will have to do some changes. So you can first increase the temperature to around 10, right here, tint to around positive 5, exposure to around 0.2 or 3 as you want, contrast will be positive 10. Highlights will be negative 30 or about. Shadows will be negative 10. Whites will be negative 5. And blacks will be negative 30. Like this. You can decrease the whites. Perfect. Now doing that, you have to click on radial filter option right here. You can first start by decreasing the temperature to around 30 or 40, like this, tint to around 15, positive 15, exposure to around 1 or 1.5, contrast will be negative 1, highlights can be around negative 12 and shadows will be around negative 30. After you have done that, click on OK to apply. Now create a new layer from the layers panel, you can name it brushes like this and then choose the brush option and choose any of these snow brush. I will give the download link in description so you don't have to worry. Now select the snow brush according to the picture and simply add it. I'm gonna use this one. Let's decrease the size to around. 1200 Let's increase to 1500 perfect and then apply it like this there are many snow brushes so you can choose any one you want like this after you have done that you can choose the eraser tool right here and make sure the brush layer is selected in the layers panel and then you can clear the snow effect from the main part of your picture like this so that will give a really nice effect like this now to give it a better look you can choose the duplicated layer here go to the layers panel and then go to gradient map choose the gradient color choose this one let's change this color to blue dark blue right here click ok click ok and choose the blend mode to screen you can decrease the opacity as you want so here is our snow effect ready guys. I hope you liked it. Please like, comment and share it with your friends. Have fun. Bye bye.